Now let's talk about how cell signaling um, is related to Parkinson's disease. Parkinson's disease is a disorder of the brain involving the breakdown of nerve cells which are, affects the creation of dopamine, a chemical created by nerve cells that sends signals to the part of the brain controlling movement. The signal transduction pathway involved in the dopamine receptor are a class of G protein coupled receptors that are prominent in the vertebrae central nervous system. The error that occurs in Parkinson's brain is the lack of dopamine. The ligand, however, everything else in the pathway is the same as a healthy G protein receptor system. The cellular response to Parkinson's is apoptosis, or cell suicide. Common symptoms of Parkinson's disease include hand shaking, arm, leg shaking, stiffness of muscles, slow and limited movement, weakness of face, throat, and muscles, and difficulty walking. There's no cure for Parkinson's disease, but there are treatments to lessen the effects of the symptoms, such as dopamine replacement therapy, like levodopa, which, cur which converted enzymes in the brain to create dopamine to reduce the one's loss, temporarily hiding the effects of Parkinson's disease. So basically, right here, this is going to be your axon of your neurotransmitter. This is going to be the end where the signal is going to come through. And this is going to be our cell. So, in normal cell communications, the axon would be transmitting the signal, in this case it's going to be dopamine, to the G protein receptors, which would carry that signal out like any other normal um, G protein receptor system like we saw earlier. So, in this case, there's tons of dopamine coming out of that one axon and being accepted by several different um, G protein receptors. So this is what a normal neuron cell looks like in communication. The way Parkinson's, Parkinson's uh, disease is identified is by the fact that the axon does not produce even, hat, even a quarter as much dopamine as a normal neuron would. So everything still works healthily and still functions exactly like a G protein receptor system once on the inside of the cell, but it just doesn't send as much dopamine to um, control movement and such, and therefore uh, the cell signaling is a lot slower and weaker, and this is what causes Par Parkinson's disorder.